strong. Good morning, Good Toys. This is Carly and Ellie. Today is Friday, April 29th, 2022. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, I pledge allegiance, allegiance to, to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence while we reflect on today's activities and focus on demonstrating our best behavior. Please be seated. Warriors, some of you are not using your agenda when moving throughout the halls. Your agenda must be with you at all times, especially when you go to connections. A warrior is always responsible, respectful of the rules. We will be right back after these messages. Summer preview of math concepts. Monday through Thursday, June 6th to June 16th. 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. or 1 p.m. to 3 p.m. Welcome to 7th graders going into 8th grade algebra or accelerated geometry. Also, 8th graders going into 9th grade algebra or accelerated geometry. Test tips, milestone testing. Charge Chromebooks the night before testing. Get a, at least eight hours of rest. Take test practice seriously even if you've already done it. Good luck, Warriors. Testing in the morning from 8.23 to 10.07. A warrior is always responsible and respectful of the rules. Please move to the halls quietly. No devices, mouse on testing. No devices, mouse on testing. Watch phones, games, and noises. Don't be upset for consequences. 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 and 200 students, 700 yearbooks were, were pre-ordered. Only 140 of you remaining. Will you get one? Don't miss out. Hurry to order. Buy the yearbook at www.justinsyearbook.com. Get that yearbook. It's the book that brings memories back. T today is Friday or Friday. Don't forget to bring your $2 if you want to purchase some. <laughs> It's Royal Friday, I'm on my way. A place to choose from, let's celebrate. It's Royal Friday, I'm on my way. A place to choose from, let's celebrate. All students are advised to use the tunnel of going to McDonald's or Chick-fil-A after school. For your safety, please do not cross Highway 54. Please reserve the privilege of gathering at Chick-fil-A. We expect you to be on your best behavior. Don't forget, a warrior is always responsible, respectful, and ready to learn. And now for the character lesson. Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Roth. And Kaylee. With a few words of wisdom. Four centuries ago, Zacharias Jansen asked the question, are there forms of life on our planet that cannot be seen by the human eye? For most people, the answer was no, but Zacharias Jansen did not accept that answer. He invented the microscope and discovered an expansive world of microscopic life forms. Zacharias Jansen expanded his mind and the entire world as people knew it. Expanded. So today, think big, then have the courage to think bigger and beyond bigger. Your world might open up in surprising ways. With something to think about, this is Kaylee. And Roth. Make it a great day or not. The choice is always yours. Good 
morning Big Warriors. This is Lindsay bringing you the, the weather for Friday, April 29th. The high for today will be 80 degrees with a low of 58 degrees. There is a 0% chance of rain, so there will be recess. This weekend, there will be it'll be in the 80s, and there will be rain on Sunday. Have a great weekend, Warriors! Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Zoe with the lunch choices for Friday, April 29th, 2022. Your choice of entrees are Wild Mike's Cheese Pizza, Wild Mike's Pepperoni Pizza, a grilled chicken sandwich, or a jammer pack. Your choice of sides are green beans, a fresh banana, or a fresh garden salad with light dressing. As always, there will be a choice of milk. Have a great day, Warriors! And today, on your handsome host, Graham, we have a joke from Chiron Chicockler. What kind of shoes do burglars wear? Sneakers! Respectful of your environment. The earth is your friend. Kids and teachers, poems for Poem in a Pocket may be read today, April the 25th, through Friday, April the 29th. How does Poem in a Pocket work? The poem from the bulletin board in the media center. Read your poem to a staff member at school, put your name on the back of the poem, date the poem, and have the staff member sign the back of the poem. Bring the signed poem to the media center during homeroom or literacy to receive candy. Students may only read one poem per day, and students who wish to read more than one poem may not read the same poem. Welcome back to Sports Talk. I'm your host, Elijah. And Gus. The Heat beat the Hawks, winning four games. Sadly, the Hawks only won one game, knocking them out of the playoffs. The final game of the NBA Finals are already almost here. Game 1 will be on June 2nd, and Game 7 will be on June 19th. There are only 12 teams left, so we'll have to see what teams can pull out the next wins. So far in the MLB, the Blue Jays have the most wins in the AL East, with 11. They are looking pretty solid with their standings right now. Currently, the Braves are in a three-game series against the Cubs. The series is tied 1-1, one one, and the final game is Thursday, April 28th. Finally, let's talk about the NFL. A little while ago, Tom Brady announced he was returning to the NFL after retiring. I think that's a bad decision, because he's already 44 and the best quarterback of all time. What do you think? I think he will still be able to win, even though he's played for so long. That's all for Sports Talk. I'm your host, Gus. And Elijah. See you next time on Sports Talk.